Hey everyone, Shabby Gamer here, and welcome back to some more Fallout 4. And finally, today, we are going to make our trip to Far Harbor. So we need to go to Diamond City and speak to Ellie, who of course is um, Nick Valentine's helper. So if my memory serves me right, it is round the back down here. Detective... Doodly loo down here. Yes, it is. Right, we're here. So we'll enter here, speak to Ellie, and I believe she's going to point us in the right direction of how to get to Far Harbor. It is Far Harbor, isn't it? I, for some reason, I want to keep calling it Far Point, but I don't we know why. New case while you and Nick were out. Ready to put on the detective hat? Oh, we can do detective stuff as well, can't we? Okay. Tell me more. Our client is a fisherman who lives on the edge of the Commonwealth, Kenji Nakano. Nakano? Huh. That name takes me back. Hmm. My memory's a little fuzzy on the details, though. Maybe if you bothered writing things down, Nick. Can't do that. Wouldn't want to put you out of a job. Huh. I'll remember that the next time you need me to console a hysterical client. Mr. Nakano didn't leave many details. Said he'd go over everything when you meet him. But if you want my guess, missing person case. Guy had a worried look a mile long. Anything you can tell me about Kenji Nakano? Just some impressions. He was obviously upset, but he was also in a hurry. Like, he couldn't stand just waiting around. I'm a friend of Nick's. He'll remember me. I need his help right away. And then he was gone. He was muttering something on the way out, but... No. I'm not sure it was important. Come on, Ellie. Don't hold out on me. What did he say? Well, I thought I heard him say something about a daughter and also a radio, but... I might have misheard him. Not sure how the two would be connected. I'll go check it out. Thanks, Ellie. The Nakano residence is up in the northeast, near the coast. A small fishing house. He said that he and his wife will be waiting for you. It's a long walk. <laughs> That's how the hard cases always start. Was that the Far Harbor case, was it? Was that... Oh, that is. That, this is point, part of the Far Harbor mission. Okay. Okay, so we need to go um, and see this guy. What I might actually do quickly, thinking about it, is I might just nip back to Castle and grab Ada. Because if we're going to go off to a brand new land, which I believe is going to be quite highly leveled for us as well, it's going to be pretty difficult, I believe. So I think taking Ada might be our best bet. We want to have our strongest ally with us. So I think we can fast travel from here. So I'm just going to whiz over to... Where else do we need to go anyway? Where is it? Where's the mission going to be? Yeah, it's over here. It's... It's right up in this top corner, so we could actually fast travel to the Museum of Witchcraft and walk up there maybe. I think that might be the best bet. But let's nip back to Castle and we will grab Ada. I don't know if we can fast travel back and forth between this place and um, Far Harbor. I think it might be worth... I don't know. We'll, we'll go over there anyway and we'll see how we get on. I'm just worried. I'm just thinking about whether we should take a power armor with us or not. But I think we should be okay. If worst comes to worst, I'm sure we could probably come back at some point. And then, um, and then we can uh, grab our power armor and go back if we need to. Um, but with Ada around, we should be we should be pretty indestructible anyway because her attack is immense. As long as we can just keep hitting enough, I think we've got like sixty or seventy stim packs on us now as well. So we'll let Ada do a lot of the damage, and we can just hide out behind her and let, <laughs> let her take all the flak as well. Because I think from a couple of videos here and there I've seen on YouTube, there are some pretty big and scary uh, scary opponents over in Far Harbor. We're gonna have some interesting stuff. What about you? What's this? Ada? Would you like me to go with you? I would indeed, my friend. Time to hit the road. Understood. Please, lead on. Send Hancock, you can stay in Castle, please. Always handy to have you here to come back to. I don't know why everyone was out there attacking. Whatever it was, it didn't last very long, did it? There must have been something around here that sort of spawned there's an uh, institute rifle on the floor there I can't see whatever it was that was around here obviously didn't last very long did it okay so let's now fast travel up to Lulu here with the asylum maybe the creamery I think the creamery is going to be the closest by looks we'll fast travel up to the creamery and we'll walk across from there so it is a missing persons case. Is that going to send us over to Far Harbor for the missing persons case? Is that going to be it? Hmm, I don't honestly know. Where is my documentation? Because I have been clever here. I 
have printed off. If I can find it. Doobie doobie doo. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I'm trying to be organised for this one. I'm sure I have it here somewhere. I'll have to find it in for next episode. I printed off a um, a quest list to make sure we could do every single mission on this expansion pack because I want to try and uh, complete it all. It looks like some sort of settlement on the top of that building or that bridge. I don't think is where we're going to. So we hope we can just like sneak past it without too much of a problem. Oh, up we go. Come on, I'm stuck. There we go. Ugh. Right, we're back up. We're up. So uh, yeah, we'll get across here and we will go to... I'm, I'm looking forward to this actually. I've not um, touched any of the expansion so far, as you well know, because of this massive playthrough. Episode 108 now, which is absolutely crazy to think. I didn't think I'd spend this much on one game, but there you go. And of course now we're on Skyrim as well, so it's going to it's going to be exactly the same with Skyrim. What the hell is it? There's a generator here. Huh. Oh, AD, you frightened the life out of me. I'm trying to activate this generator, and a big red light just arrived. What is this then? Scan for components. This is pretty cool, isn't it? What do we need? We need aluminium, didn't we? Wait for iBot to locate aluminium. Critical failure in iBot remote communication link. Unable to connect to the iBot. All recall and administration functions are offline. No idea what I've just done there. No idea whatsoever, but it looks pretty cool. Maybe if we come back here at some point, maybe we'll get some aluminium from that. Why the map just shake? I'm sure everything just shook there for a second. Okay, well, I'll continue on. I can jump off this because I'm, I'm not in my power armor, am I? I can't. Remember, I can jump off stuff when I can't. All right. There's a lighthouse above us with a light on, which would indicate there might be some life there. What is this on our map? Can we discover it? Hey. Well, maybe I shouldn't discover it. Come on, take him down. Oh, he's uh, he's got pretty good health, hasn't he? I'm trying to use my advantage, my uh, my strength. Oh, he's a veteran, he is. Let's see how good he is when he's got some uh, some Grognak's axe in the head. Do it again. These guys are pretty good health, aren't they? Maybe I should go to a gun. I'm trying to be a bit more intelligent with the... Uh, there we go. We've got the Coastal College. I'm trying not to carry around too many weapons at once. I had to kill him before I had a chance to uh, get into him. Right, there we go. Right, I, let's switch across to a gun now, I think. I don't even know why I'm here. <laughs> I should just ignore this, but I just wanted to mark it on the map since we're here. Let's let's go for this. I've not used it before. Where are you, Ada, anyway? I found somebody. Just setting fire to a tree of it. Oh, how did you find a super mutant? I don't know how she's found a super mutant. Oh my god, there's a death claw over there as well. Where, where is she finding all this stuff? Right. Let's um attack the death claw because I don't want to have to fight that on my own. I'd rather have the super mutants helping us. I've forgotten the button to this game now. Yeah. Come on, Ada, 
take it down. I do not want to get in a fight with this death row on my own. Oh, the death door down. Right. I don't know how we found this massive fight out in bloody nowhere. I tell you, there were super mutants down there. There's raiders up here. There's a bloody death claw. They really don't want us near here, did they? What is that? My god, there's bloody glowing Mylurks now as well. Right, that's that Mylurk dead. Do we want to go for the legendary glowing one? We could do, but where's he gone? If we can get somewhere where he can't reach us, that'd be great. Where could we go, though? Is this... Can I get on the top of this truck? I can get here. Where's he gone? He was over there, wasn't he? There it is. Picking up something. Ada is coming. I'm hopefully going to be out of his range, but he can't reach us. I hope he can. He can still reach us. Hey, if you could refrain from blowing me up, that'd be great. There we go, I'm up on the top now. Where's he gone? Oh, hey, they're taken down, there we go. Legendary down as well. This has been a mental episode, it really has. Right. Oh, 50 damage resistance while aiming. Steadfast assault rifle, that's not too bad. Right now, I think I'm done with this area now. Let's, should we have a look inside this house to see if there's anything there? Because with the stuff we've had to kill to get here, there must be some good stuff. My alert, we'll take that. There's literally nothing here at all. Why was it? Why is there so much stuff defending it then? Or is there ah, an underground area here? What's in the underground area? Nothing. It just seems odd with with the amount of defence and everything that's around it, or the amount of stuff they've spawned around it, it just seems odd not to find anything of any use, doesn't it, really? Ah, oh, well, we'll continue on. We'll continue on doing what we should be doing, rather than uh, rather than messing around here. Now it's raining. So where are we going? We're going down this way, by the looks of it. Um, let's have a quick look at the map to make sure we're not on B point across water. We need to follow this follow this um, this round now, by the looks of it. Follow it round to the right, and then we should come across the house we are looking for, and we can then travel to Far Harbour. Finally get into it. We're going to try and do Far Harbour uh, and complete it all, and then we're going to go um, probably do the... Might do the Vault one after Far Harbour, and then we'll go and do the new Coca-Cola world. Then I think we'll come back onto the main Fallout game, and I'll just try and complete everything. Is that something alive? No, it's a bit of fence. Then we'll try and, yeah, we'll try and go completionist. We'll try and get all the bobbleheads and all that sort of stuff. Um, but of course we are going to do these two expansion packs first. I believe we want to be up on that cliff, don't we? So how do we get up on that cliff? What's Ada found? A super mutant skirmisher. The hell's there a Mylurk up there? Was he always up there? That was crazy. What's he doing up there? Holy hell. This place is bloody dangerous up here, isn't it? We're now being dragged through this little corridor. Just so we can hook up to the right up on the... Uh, oh, need some water. Which didn't seem to harm us rads-wise, which is good. Ada, you're going to have to spawn back in behind me because I know you're not getting up that hill. We know you're not getting up that hill. Do I need to be up? I'm going to go up here as well. I don't know if I need to be up here or not, but I just feel like we may as well. You cannot go that way. I cannot go which way? Is it trying to hint to me that I need to be... Where do I need to be here? You cannot go that way. 
I need to be up on the bridge, don't I? Do I need to be up on the bridge? Just looking that way, but there's no way up on the bridge, is there? So where, where do I need to go then, game? Where do I need to go? You're the one that's pointing me up there. Oh, I'm well confused here. I'm well confused. Um, uh, yeah. Well, it's pointing me there, so wh how do I get there? I'm still going this way. Screw you. Well, how do I get there, then? Right here? Is this the way? Ah. Or is it the way? I don't honestly know. It looks like this might be the way then. It looks like this is linked up to allow me... Uh, let's, there we go. Literally just... It needs to go around this way around the bridge. That's all it is. Where are we now map-wise? Oh, we're getting well off the map now, aren't we? Are we getting to Far Harbour now then? Or do we have to take a boat or something? There we go, I'm 90, 90 something or ever away. I'm gonna let some sort of golf course. I'm stuck in a bunker. So how am I gonna get to where I need to go? Is it down? Ah, here we go, there's a house. That's what I'm looking for, this house. Right. Boom, we're here. We are here. Damn it, come in. I know you're listening on the other end. Where is she? Where is my daughter? Can't you... What? Who are you? I'm sorry, but we don't have time for visitors or caravans or wherever you're from. I'm with Valentine's Detective Agency. You asked for help? Oh, thank God. You have to get working right away. So, what's the story with you and Nick? That is not important right now. You have to help me find my daughter. I'm here to help. Tell me what happened. It's all thanks to this damn radio. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. The radio was her latest project. Until she made contact with some kidnapper who lured her away from her. Well, maybe she left on her own. She's not a child anymore. Our daughter... It is. I'm gonna fight outside. She knows how to survive and she's capable. I... think maybe she left because she wanted her own life. No. She would have told us what bloody hell's going on outside. She would have said something. I know my daughter is in danger. I can't believe it. Find her, please. Let's talk money. Investigations for the mission of the chief. I am not going to barter over my daughter's life. Your fee is going to be 300 cash. Take it or leave it. Bloody things. Try and do a mission and we're being attacked. Come on, go down. Is that them all? Right, thank you. Mr. Nakano. I'm sorry, but we're dealing with the family. You were shouting about a missing daughter. What happened? A good Samaritan? Fine. I'm out of options anyway, if you want to hear about it. My daughter is missing. It all started with this damn radio. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. The radio was her latest project. Until she made contact with some kidnapper who lured her away from us. Or maybe she left on her own. She's not a child anymore. Our daughter is 19. She knows how to survive and she's capable. I... I think maybe she left because she wanted her own life. No, she would have told us where she was going. She would have said something. I know my daughter is in danger. I can feel it. Find her, please. Do you have any idea where she could have gone? We know she took one of the boats, but that's all. She could be anywhere. I'll find her. Don't you worry. Thank you. Her room is upstairs if that helps. And if you had any more questions about her, just ask. 
Okay, so investigate the residence. Optional question Excuse these two, okay. Mr. Nakano, did you have questions about my daughter? Tell me more about this radio she was fixing. I've tried to get that damn thing to work over and over again, but there's nothing. I thought she just wanted to strip it for parts or build a toaster out of it or something, like she usually does. Someone made contact with her, and then they took her. God, what kind of twisted psychopath has my daughter? Anything more you can tell me about Kasumi? The smallest detail could be important. I don't know what more to say. She's my little girl, and she doesn't know how dangerous this world is. I never should have let her grandfather teach her how to fix these machines. Her grandfather? He taught her how to fix the radio? Ever since she was old enough to walk, yes. Her grandfather had an ear for machines. Kasumi picked up the knack. He passed away recently. He used to scavenge the ruins in the south for parts. I kept telling him he was getting too old. Why did your daughter really leave? Your wife says she left on her own, but you said it was kidnappers. I know it was kidnappers. Kasumi is a smart girl, but she doesn't know how horrible people can be. Not like me and Rei. Why would she just leave her family with no explanation? Someone tricked her, got her to leave the safety of home. Every minute we aren't looking for my daughter, her life is in jeopardy. No more questions right now. Work quickly, Detective. Mrs. Nakano. I suppose you have questions about my daughter. You and your husband don't seem to agree about why your daughter left. <sighs> we both want to find her. The world out there isn't a place where you want to be alone. But Kenji still sees her swaddled in diapers. He doesn't see a young woman with her own decisions to make. Maybe because it's more frightening. She wasn't tricked into leaving without telling us. That was her choice. She didn't want us to follow. Why? Tell me more about this radio your daughter was working on. I remember Kasumi was very excited about it. I figured she was secretly trying to make contact with Diamond City or another settlement. We're pretty isolated out here. She only has us for company and Kenji can be... overprotective. I'd like to know more about Kasumi might shine a light on where she's gone. My daughter is strong, focused, careful. That's how I know she's still alive. But why would she leave without telling us? Maybe we... No, never mind. I don't want to waste your time. Every detail is important, Mrs. Nakano. Don't hold back. It's just that we've been fighting a lot more. All of us. Ever since Kasumi's grandfather passed away. He was the only one that could really talk to her. Kenji and I don't understand machines, but those two could work together for hours. She started staying in her grandfather's boathouse late into the night. I thought she was just trying to cope with the loss, but now I wonder what she was up to. Mm hmm. Okay. Nothing else right now. So we have found some information out by questioning the parents. Check out the old boathouse, see what there is over here. So then if, if I was in this situation, I don't know if I would put loads of lights around my place, because it would it would just sort of um entice people, wouldn't it? From a distance, right. So there's lots of stuff in here. Lovingly cared for picture of a lighthouse almost seems out of place here. Search the picture frame. You find a kid a hidden key. Well that was pretty easy, wasn't it? I I honestly didn't know that was there, honestly. <laughs> Now I've got to try and find what the key fits to. Um, I'll take all that. Oh, don't you worry, Ada, I will. Um, what is the key for? Put this on the outside, maybe? Uh... Hmm. So we found a key, but no idea what the key is for. What's this little room here? 
think, in there. So it definitely is something in here by the looks of it. Is that going to be like a secret doorway or...? Ah. The note here as well. My dear Kasumi, if you ever get locked out of the safe, then the answer is here in the boathouse. The picture is where the key is. Okay. That's fine. That's, that's what the key's for then, the safe. So what's in the safe? Some duct tape? And Kasumi's final follow tape. Let's listen. Um, myself. I never really thought about who or what I am, but God, where do I start? The radio. I was right about the range. I managed to get a signal, a strong signal from up north. There's a group of people up there. They say they're all synths. Synthetic people. Made by the Institute. They are trying to build a place for their kind. Where they can be themselves and be accepted for what they are alongside human beings. It sounds wonderful, but... Then they started asking about me and some questions came up. Questions I don't have answers to. I mean, I've always felt off. Like, I'm not really supposed to be here, but then there are things in my childhood I can't remember, and I've been having strange dreams. I... I'm going to go to meet these synths. I... I have to know the truth about myself. They've told me to sail up north to a town called Far Harbor. I can make my way to them from there. Interesting. Very, very interesting. That almost to me sounds like that she believes she could be a simp. So that's very interesting. Okay. So let's go back and tell the parents to see what they've got to say about this. And I should imagine... Ah, oh, the fog's gone. Lovely. It's not nice around here when there's no fog, then it? it looks like quite a nice little settlement, actually. There's a cat! Colonel the Manowington. Commodore me out into the second. Right, hello. Have you hello. finished your investigation? Did you find anything? Oh yeah. I need to ask you an important question. Are you sure your daughter is human? What kind of question is that? Why are you asking? Your daughter made contact with a group of synths. She thinks she's one of them. What? That's... That's crazy. She's not a synth. She's our daughter. We raised her. I... I gave birth to her. She's flesh and blood, not a synthetic. Are you sure she's human, Mrs. Nakano? Yes. I know my daughter, and she hasn't changed. She's not some replacement. This is what I was afraid of. Someone twisting my daughter's mind. Did you find where Kasumi went, Detective? I think I know where Kasumi went. A place called Far Harbor. She went that far up north? God, that explains why she took the boat. You have to go after her. Please, take my other ship on the dock outside. My father's design. It has a guidance system, and it is built for distance. What can I expect out there, Kenji? I only made the trip to Far Harbor once, when I was a boy. All I remember is that my father did not want to stay long. Something about the air being bad. I'll get to the bottom of this, Kenji. Thank you. And here, the payment we discussed. I'll have something more when Kasumi is safely back home. Nice 300 coins. So there we go. Ooh. So we've got some, uh, some extra little options that we can do now. We can tell the Brotherhood and we can tell the railroad about what there is there. And I think we might actually do that in the next episode. But of course, there we are at the 30 minute mark. Um, so what are those? Are they, they're both miscellaneous quests. We might go and do both of those. Um, I don't know what the Brotherhood... The Brotherhood don't really necessarily... I don't know. The Brotherhood hate simps? I can't actually remember. Yeah, the Brotherhood do hate simps, don't they? Huh, interesting. 
Okay, so that is going to be the end of this episode. I hope you have enjoyed it. Of course, next episode, we will go and tell the Railroad and the Brotherhood about the Simph uh, Refuge, just in case it gives us any bonuses. And then, of course, we will finally travel to Far Harbor. And, of course, I hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you have, then please do hit that like button. It does make the video easier for other people to find. And why not drop me a comment and let me know what you think about this playthrough as well. I've been Chevy Gamer. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you all very, very soon for another episode of Fallout 4.